bonjour. Uh, here I am, so I've just done the boring bit of the trip up to the top of the downs. Um, just to do my favourite loop. Uh, it's pretty windy up here, but that's kind of nice because it's super, super hot today. Um, so down there, that's where I've come from, somewhere doo -doo -doo -doo, over there. And where we're going to is the aerials over there, and then from there we're going to follow the trail down to the top of Southwick, which is um, my favourite bit. It's uh, actually a really nice downhill trail. So you might look at that and go, well, that's not very far. But uh, the problem is that there are uh, one, two, and then a third climb that just suck. Absolutely sick. Uh, I the last one up to the aerials is pretty lumpy, rocky gravel. Um, and uh, I end up spinning on it loads. I've only made it up here a handful of times when I've been in pretty good shape and after this lockdown uh, that I am not. So let's see how this goes.
Feels like you get to this corner and you hit the finish, but no, There's another little bit more. And I'll be making a stop at the crossroads for the uh, link that goes I think back down to Southwick. Um, have some water. I'm sure there's plenty of people that do this every morning and just smash it out in one go, but I'm not in that kind of condition right now. Far from it. Oh. Hello. This guy's got the same idea. So, there's our next destination. Around here, there's a really awesome downhill. There's actually quite a uh, nifty tabletop, which um, I've accidentally cleared once before. Uh, there's almost always someone on it, because there's a tree, it's a really nice bit of shade. So I will absolutely be skipping that, also because I've seen a couple of people coming down from over there. So it's going to be quite busy at the bottom and there's a group of three that's just gone over. Um, so don't want to take them out. Plus the other dude that stopped here earlier. So we'll just uh, keep up here on the high path. Drop the gear, drop the seat. Yeah, feet in condition. Wow. So this is a really, really nice run over here. Uh, amazing view up the top there. But I just want to smash this hill. Still getting to grips with these code R brakes as well. They're, uh, they feel spongy, but actually 
sus beasts, but they're bloody e-bikes as well. They're gonna absolutely chomp this. I hate it. Hello. Hello ladies. Come again. Uh, I just realised I did that entire descent of the forks locked out. This side, less of the big track, but it's at the top of the camber. throughout this last year uh, really making a concerted effort since kind of about now in 2020 um, it's coming up here I've been here for almost 20 years and it's really just in the last two that uh, I've bothered exploring the downs um, I don't know why, I think maybe just from being in the centre of town all the time, uh, you know, other priorities, um, just wasn't really paying attention. Riding has changed that. Thank you. Oh, I didn't have to go. No, I'll try. I wouldn't have been happy. Fucking oh, hell. Oh. So, this is all in a bit of preparation because uh, next week I'm going on a bit of a cycling holiday down to the New Forest. And, uh, Back with 
going to go to uh, Bike Park at Tidworth and uh, not done any park riding since the end of last year. No, actually the beginning of this year. And uh, I am not ready. <laughs> but it'll still be fine. stables. This is the start of the main descent and uh, there's another climb before we get onto the final stretch but this bit's pretty pretty rapid uh, and it can also be really sketchy especially when it's dry. But I, haven't, uh, I haven't dropped the tyre pressure so I'm kind of running getting up here and around town pressure is pretty high probably sort of like late 30s at most.
nice up here. I was hoping for some berries. How are we doing? 
Oh. <laughs> well, I understand. It's really sunny. I'd be excitable too. That's okay. Have a lovely day. That did me a favour. There's quite a court down here. Yeah.